Hello everyone, welcome to Tector.com. In last lecture, we understood the use of group by clause. Now, let's start with understanding the problem to understand having clause in this lecture. So, we have a movie table in our database which has attribute MID, title, year, rating, and votes. Now, write down the query for list, listing down the <coughs> year wise number of movies released. So what we will write, we will write select year and count of MID from movie and group by year, year right. So what will be the output? So the output would be something like this right, the year and the count of MID and then the it will list the number of movies released in a particular year right now let's say we want to imply here some condition and let's say we want to list down the only those years which has number of movies released greater than 50 okay so basically we will list only those years like this one this one we will not list this one we will not list this one okay so we will list a year only if the number of movies released is greater than 50 so what modification we will do here so after this group by we need to also add the condition that this count should be greater than 50 right so that is done with the help of having clause Okay, so with group by we will write having having this count MID greater than 50 right so this having is used with this aggregate function okay so with aggregate function always having clause is used fine so now it will filter out these rows or these records which has this count less than 50 so using this having clause we can perform filtration over this group by okay so over groups so group by will create groups and using this having clause we can filter out subset of group which is required okay so I hope this is clear if you have any doubt please go to the tech and ask your doubt in the doubt section Thanks for watching.